Did you enjoy your idli breakfast? And what about the leftover idlis? I have a recipe for that too. Let's make idli uppet. Never be sad for the leftover idlis. In fact, we prepare extra idlis just to make idli uppet the next day. And this recipe works good only if the idlis are old, not with the freshly made idlis. Also, this works well only if the idlis are prepared with idli rava and urad dal. This doesn't work well with the idlis made with rice. Let's begin with the recipe. Here I have taken 1 spoon of mustard seeds, a handful of ground nuts, half spoon jeera, 1 spoon urad dal, a little turmeric, 1 onion and few green chilies. Chop onion and green chilies. Now I have taken about 10 to 12 idlis. These are the leftover idlis from yesterday. Now break them with your hands and make a fine powder. Don't apply too much pressure, lightly crush them into powder. All the idlis are powdered now. Now heat a pan and add 1 to 1 and half spoons of oil and add mustard seeds. Let the mustard seeds splutter. Now add the urad dal and let the urad dal turn into brown color. Once the urad dal is brown, add the jeera or cumin seeds. Then add the ground nuts. Here I have taken dry roasted ground nuts, so I am not frying them for a long time. I will just quickly mix them and add the further ingredients. Now I am adding onion and green chilies. Mix everything together nicely and then add turmeric powder. Mix everything well and cook till the onions become translucent. Then add very little salt. Remember that even idlis have salt. So add salt accordingly. Mix once again. Now we will add the idli powder. Gently mix everything together. Once it is mixed, cover the lid and let it cook for 2 to 3 minutes. Then open the lid and mix everything again. And that's it, the tasty breakfast. Idli Uppet is ready to serve. Enjoy this recipe with the leftover idlis made from idli rava and urad dal. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you enjoyed making this recipe. Please subscribe for more videos.